I can't you do your hands, honey. You're going to be fine right here. I promise. Please do it, please, Daddy. He can't do that. Liquid hydrogen replenished on the external tank is being terminated as planned. Kaylee, you're going to have to get on my shoulders. That's the only way I can do it. Okay, Daddy. Okay, come here. No, not like that. No, on no, your one shoulder. No, no, I can't, Pumpkin, because I can't. I won't be able to hold the camera. Come on, put your head. Minute, Thirty seconds and counting. All the systems are go. It's good. About ninety yeah. seconds it's away from the Hooray! Hooray! What is it? It's right. I'm recording. Yay! What is it? Twenty-eight times a charm. Or? <laughs> T minus one minute, 10 seconds and counting. The liquid hydrogen tank inside the external tank is now at the proper flight pressure. T minus one minute and counting. The ground loss sequencer will verify that the three main engines are ready to start. The booster joint heaters are being deactivated at this time. Daddy. Yes, ma'am. T minus 48 seconds. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. I can see from down there. No, you can't. Can. You want to see from down here? Are you sure? Are you I, can, I can see down. Coming up, we're going to go for an auto sequence start. Look, T minus right 31 Don't hold on. seconds. 31 seconds. No, not. Look, Kaylee show. gets, gets situated. Now yeah, we have a go for auto sequence start. Discovery Stay right here. I'll move. That primary control of all the vehicle's critical functions. 20 seconds. The fast suppression water system has been activated, protecting Discovery and the launch pad from acoustical energy waves. Go for, for main engine start. Shh, shh, shh. It's getting, it's going now. Listen, 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 listen. Look, look, look. Two, one. Booster ignition and the final liftoff of Discovery. Oh my goodness. The engines are going to come off the sides. Uh oh. Oh, it's still okay. Mission specialist Mike Barrett and Steve Bowen. Discovery's three main engines are burning fuel at a rate that would drain an average swimming pool in about 25 minutes. Help me down, Daddy. Okay, help me, Mommy, help me out. The engines combined with the solid rocket boosters produce more than 7 million pounds of thrust. One minute, 50 seconds into the flight, we're standing by for separation of the twin solid rocket boosters. Discovery now traveling 2,695 miles an hour. It's altitude 24 miles. Downrange from the Kennedy Space Center, 29 miles. I can see it from here. <laughs> <laughs> Booster separation confirmed. Discovery's guidance did not be broken. The booster settled on board to do it. Coming through the front. I can't believe it. I can't believe it either. It's up to 237 miles. Don't reach the Kennedy Space Center. Stop, Scott, that's not. 
Discovery now getting a boost into orbit from its twin orbital maneuvering system engines on either side of the shuttle's tail. These two engines will bear up to two minutes and 32 seconds. Where are they? Look for the engines. Look for the you boosters. Your no -com, no and we did launch late into the Oh, they should be coming straight here. Yeah. 